I'm very happy to have you in front of the camera and ask you a couple of questions. How are you doing? Uh, a bit tired, but everything is going pretty well. So it's, it's history is made here in Rotterdam. Well, it is a celebration. It's not a normal ICRA. ICRA at Ford is really to celebrate 40 years of history of, of the society, the council and then the society. And, and it is absolutely fantastic to see, you know, people. There was even a presentation of uh, Rina Bacci, 92 years old, who was, was talking about, you know, how vision started, so to speak. So it's fantastic to see the history. And I think also for students, for younger people, this is a, really a unique event. Uh, what would you consider the top three topics that are on people's minds today as they walk here on your event? Well, you know, it's, it's the public and there are the scientists. Of course, for the public, AI is a, you know, is a very buzzword that they don't even know what it means. People here do know what it means. And there are a lot of debates about that. So what it is, what is not, uh, what can give and what it cannot give. And I think that here they are, you know, real serious debate with knowledge behind on to see what we can do with these kind of actions. And of course, and it's what is nice to see is that the people here do realize and recognize that, uh, you know, AI without a proper body is completely useless for robotics. Yeah, that is, a, that is a fascinating aspect. So you actually expect a fusion of, let's say, hardware and AI for the coming years to play a big part in our society? Yes, so yesterday I was actually part of a debate and it was very clear that, you know, what people think that they are the biggest major uh, challenges in robotics is not related to AI, it's actually related to actuation <laughs> and the hardware. And I need to, you can build and integrate actuation. You know, I mentioned uh, Anaxagoras, who was a pre Socratic, uh, Socratic uh, uh, philosopher, that said that the humans are the most intelligent of the animals because they have hands and we are not able to make hands yet as human hands. I mean, we have very nice hands, but that's still a very big challenge. Do you think that challenge will be solved by the industry or do you think um, th there will be uh, robot makers that are, will actually start to make their own actuators? No, no, I think that is research first. I think we, we need to change the paradigm very likely. So we need to, to go to, to kind of bio uh, kind of, uh, of materials. There will be a, a shift. You know, robotics is, is just doing whatever is needed in order to create robots. And we have seen it again and again. I think that materials will play a major role in the future. That's my expectation.